um, I thought I'd just show you this actually <laughs> it's a fruit machine <laughs> one of my first games I played uh, on the Amstrad GX, uh, Amstrad GX 1000 see getting it wrong again straight away Amstrad CPC and um, it's not the greatest game in the world but it's um, one of the first games uh, I played on the uh, CPC when I got it and and that's and that's why it uh, has a special place in my heart fruit machine made by Amstrad's uh, in-house um, software for 1984 Whew, that's going back a bit isn't it jeez well, I've got my um, CPC in uh, 85, 86 so it must have had um, a couple of uh, owners before or at least one owner before and they had, they had a stock of software and it came with that and then and that, oh hello look at this instant jackpot when this happens watch boom ah every time when you get the star and seven and the lemon in the middle like that oh, and watch this watch out Ooh. thank you very much for blinding me yes um and yeah it was part of the stock of games that came with the machine when we got it and uh, ooh, mostly budget titles uh, this is the one that stuck out the most. I played this the most. It was quick to load, I think that's the reason why I played it a lot. Um, and it gave the opportunity for a child to play a fruit machine because we couldn't play fruit machines in reality. So, But like I say it's very basic. There's, there's hardly any skill involved in this. Well, I say that only a little bit when it comes to the nudging because the wheels are constant. I think they're constant. I'm sure they are actually. Um, yeah, it's a little bit there, but basically you just got it's basic controls on the keypad. G for gamble, N for nudge, W for winner spinners, function keys for nudges up and down, um, and holds. Simple stuff, but does pass the time and it's rather enjoyable, especially when you beat it and you've got the high score. So it was this a combination of this and a couple of other games really, um, that remind me of my CPC that predominantly and uh, I think the other ones would be Oh Mummy that's <laughs> a silly game that is a maze game where you, you've got to go around um, tombs and, and release the mummies or escape the, escape the tombs um, another one was The Bells where you play the Hunchback of Notre Dame rescue the damsel in distress single screen um, assault courses Flipping hard. Oh, God, was it hard. Um, <laughs> and it took ages to load that game. I remember it, it took longer to load than our premium title. Mm, tapes for you. But you guys today wouldn't know that, would you? <laughs> and, of course, um, the other game that came with it was Manic Miner. And that is, well, still a classic now for me. Um, it's still a, a brilliant game, Manic Miner. It's a, the, like the epitome of homebrew games, the Manic Miner. And, oh, can we get this bar here? No. King Lemon. I am a lemon. Um, yeah, played Manic Miner a lot. I really did. And I still never completed it. It's, it's that hard. It's a hard game. It's proof that older games were harder. But I guess a combination of that, certainly Manic Miner, uh, Own Mummy, the Bells, and this. Can we get some nudges here? Mm. <sighs> Come on, let's nudge for the... Should we go for the bells? Yes, yeah, go for the bells. If we can get a bell. Lovely. Come on. Jackpot, shall we go? No, we take the winner spinners, I think. Shall we take the winner spinners? Yeah. Um. Oh, that's nice. Plums. I got me plums, two lemons, and a load of grapes. God, sounds like a load of medical condition going on there. Swollen plums, load of grapes. Anyway, I digress. This was uh, a game that I played uh, frequently, very frequently indeed. Even though it's uh, extremely um, empty of a lot of things, just beat you know, get a high score, and that's it, and carry on. Cause it's all oh, nice there. It's it's strange playing this now. It really is. But um, 
It take me. It do, does take me back to the CPC days. And the reason why I'm asking these questions, by the way, because I, I've actually forgotten to say it at the beginning of the bleeding video, is it's actually a response to Lawn Boy's post 1975, um, a question about uh, what games reminded you of your uh, first system, and not necessarily your favourite games, just what games did. So I should have mentioned that at the beginning of the video, shouldn't I, really? So sorry about that, Dave. An absolute div. But here we go. Stick me name in. Novaberg. Top of the tree. Hmm. Okay. Anyway, fruit machine. CPC. Thank you very much. See you later.